What's up guys, this is Ruben from rightlook.com coming at you with another quick project guys. Today we actually have a 2021 Porsche Taycan. Just check this out. The great thing about working in this industry guys, you get to work on these beautiful cars like this. You know, the other day we had a Bentley in here, the other, now we have a Porsche Taycan Rolls Royces, but that's the beauty about working on in this industry is you get to work on all these different types of vehicles. But what I wanna do is I wanna go ahead and focus on here. And what I wanna do is I wanna go ahead and give you like a small series of what's gonna be happening to this car. Now, this car is a 2021 Porsche Taycan and it only has 200 miles. Now, a lot of people are under the impressions like, well, my car is brand new. It doesn't need any type of protection. It doesn't need any type of, uh, you know, paint correction. Believe it or not, guys, this is the best time for you guys to actually go in there and bring the paint where it has to be. You don't want to wait a year. You don't want to wait two years. You want to do it as soon as possible. So like I mentioned, this car only has 200 miles. And as we walk across, okay, by, look, by the look of the camera, it actually looks pretty smooth. But as I'm touching it, I'm actually feeling all the contaminants that are in the paint the fallout, the metals, the railroad dust. One thing you gotta realize, guys, these, these cars come over here by ship, okay? So this was loaded in Germany. It was actually made in Stuttgart, Germany, where the Porsche manufacturer is. And what they do, these cars sit there for weeks before they put them on the boat. Well, imagine all those contaminants landing on the paint system, just sitting there in the fog, in the snow, in the sun. And all of a sudden, they put it on these transport boats that it takes about three, three and a half months to get here. So now imagine all those contaminants that are on there, of course, once you guys go to the dealership, the dealership makes them pretty because they want to present you with a beautiful looking car. But as we look deep into the actual paint, I'm actually going to grab my little light right here and I'm going to turn it on. I don't know if the camera is going to pick this up, but here in this area, you can actually see a lot of wash scratches. One thing you got to realize at these dealerships, they're, they're not, I'm not going to say they're not the best, but at the same time too, they, I mean, they're not taking the time to make these cars look immaculate. They just make them enough to where they present them to you to where they make them look good. But as we walk around, guys, you can see a lot, a little bit of oxidation. I know it's a Porsche, guys, but it looks amazing. But obviously knowing and being in this industry, we know we can make this car look better. So what we wanna do here in the next couple of videos is we actually wanna go ahead and show you the process of what's gonna happen on this vehicle. We're actually gonna be prepping the vehicle. We have to do a clay on this vehicle. And then we're gonna come back and do a paint correction. So as far as the paint, it's really not that bad where we have to do a three-stage paint correction. Most likely we're just gonna do a two-stage. And then after that, the next video we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and prep it for ceramic coating. And we're gonna be putting seven years of protection, okay? Not only are you gonna see the process uh, of its ceramic coating, but at the same time, we're also gonna show you how to maintain the ceramic coating. There's a lot of myths out there on how ceramic coating glass and the protection that's on there. But what I wanna do is guys is, towards the end of the video, I wanna go ahead and do a quick uh, presentation on how to maintain the vehicles. A lot of people are spending a lot of money investing in their coating, but a lot of times they're not getting educated on how to maintain the vehicle. So guys, stay tuned guys, and we're gonna do a lot of cool things on this car, and I want you guys to see the dramatic before and after. So guys, once again, Ruben from rightlook.com. We'll see you guys soon.